Hey, care to look at what I am reading? I am reading about the lunar eclipse. Let's see what it is. Zoom in! A lunar eclipse happens when the earth moves between the sun and the moon, blocking the sun's light from reaching the moon. Come, let's go to space and see how the lunar eclipse occurs. You see them? The sun, the earth and the moon. Look how the moon is slowly passing from the penumbra to the umbra. Hey, stop! Stop! This is the penumbra, the region beyond the umbra. Okay, moon. When the moon travels to the penumbra, we see a penumbral lunar eclipse where the moon is faintly visible to us. When the part of the moon is in the penumbra and a part of it is in the umbra, we see a partial lunar eclipse. And when the moon travels to the umbra, we see a total lunar eclipse. There are times when the moon appears to be red. Oh, don't be scared. I'll tell you how that happens. As we all know, the rays of the sun are made up of red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo and violet. When the sun rays hit the atmosphere of the earth, most of the colors get scattered away and the color red remains. Due to which we see a red or a blood moon during a total lunar eclipse. Trivia time! The word eclipse in Greek means downfall. A solar eclipse always takes place about two weeks before or after a lunar eclipse. So now you know quite a lot about the lunar eclipse, don't you? This is me zooming out. Tune in next time for more fun facts. <laughs>